my book fighters, it's Wednesday. It's also the 1st of February, which means we'll be moving on to a new book, The Fault in Our Stars by John Green. So I'm in Australia, and part of being in Australia is waiting ridiculously long times for Amazon to send stuff over. So I don't actually have my physical copy of The Fault in Our Stars. I don't have a G-Scribble yet. Um, what I do have is the audio book. Um, this is the limited edition one that's read by John Green and I'm going to be reviewing this today. So the actual CDs, there's seven of them. It's John Green's voice reading out the story of a 16 year old girl's life. He doesn't ever actually say, and then I took off my bra, which I was really disappointed in. But it, it, there's something special about hearing a book being read out by the person who wrote it, especially when it's John Green. Um, I am deeply in awe of his ability to put words together and make sentences that are beautiful. And there's a lot, there is a lot of that in this book, which I, pro I might get to next week. Um, the other things that came in the box are a DVD of special features. I haven't had a chance to watch that yet, but I'm sure it'll be amazing. The fun bit... Okay, the fun bit. Inside the box, there's also a bunch of goodies. Um, there are a heap of these cool little postcard type things from Amsterdam and Indianapolis, which are the two cities that the book is set in, which I thought was a really cool touch. That's what the bones, the funky bones look like, if, if you're wondering. Um, it also came with a wristband for the Hectic Glow, the greatest band in the world. There was also a ticket to a concert, but um, I think I've stuck that up on my wall already upstairs, so I, I don't have that to show you. So that's what's inside the audiobook box set. Uh, that DFTVA Records shipped out uh, a lot quicker than Amazon did, which I'm really grateful for. Otherwise I wouldn't have had anything to review today. So in March we will be reviewing The Importance of Being Earnest by Oscar Wilde. It's not very long, but you should definitely get on to reading that. And I think that's it. Katie, I'll see you tomorrow. Um, he doesn't actually ever say, and then I took off my bra, which... You done?